What's going on guys? Welcome to today's video. <clears throat> Currently on the way to Callie's house. I guess they went to the P.O. box and picked up some stuff. So, uh, yeah, I'm just going to head over there now and um, get started with the freaking day. Okay. Where is it? Here. Mike is here. What's up? Also, I have this here. And then I have this here. I have this here. Yes, I have a tool with literally zero shaft play at all. I have a cute little WRX turbo, dude. Jack shit in and out, front to back, nothing. E. E. No, no, the mirror, the mirror, the mirror. Very nice. I really hope these things fit. I know I'm gonna have to lift that shit dumb high. Oh, piece of shit. Never mind, cut, cut the fucking camera. Cut the fucking shit. Shit. Hello. That hurt like a bitch. I wasn't expecting to that bad, but I really smacked the shit out of that tire. You need a railing on that? That's it, guys. There goes the loft. Yo, that fucking stair is not cool, man. Yeah, that one stair is sketchy. Fucking safety violation. You fuck with it up there? I do. I to see Nick just fucking fall through. That would not be chill at all. <laughs> that would not be chill. Alright, now I have to unbolt every single one of these son of a bitch. Just like I did to mine. Because I'm not going to sit here and turn the spanner wrench 70,000 times. I'm just going to unbolt two bolts with my big fuck off impact wrench. Yeah, watch out, dude. Watch out for my railing. Best railing. Would you look yeah. at that railing? Well, yeah, I'm gonna friggin' lift this damn thing up because there's there was no way. Actually, here, here, hold this. I'm gonna try to put the tie. I'm gonna try to put the wheel in there. Cool. Uh, That'll work. <laughs> it was kind of hard Hell. to get them in there. <laughs> dude. Like, low key, if I camber it, it won't hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part of my song, nice. I'm just this is gonna be dumb high off the ground. These tires like just fit. Fuck you ordering stuff mushrooms? Stuff mushrooms. Subscribe to Koenig and PewDiePie. Ah, uh, so I have my 22 and my 13 here. That means alignment time because, uh, yeah. Oh yeah, you can see it on camera. That. Nick is trying to keep up on YouTube drama. So, uh, I've just been uh, doing this, I guess. Heat and finish the sentence. Wrench, you're fucking wrong, guys. You're wrong, damn it. Alright, now we're mint. We got all the ground clearance we could ever need. If Callie doesn't like the big tires on hers, dude, I'll put these on mine. I mean, I've had enough on these for today. You want to pull mine in just so it's in here?
am Subaru man. I do around and up over kid. Did that look cool? Yep. So you guys remember the last time? <coughs> Nick was here for his monthly break job, and he was like, yo, just, just do this side. What side am I doing now? That's just that side? And this side. And this side? Yeah, this side. Fuck this sake, side you gotta get me two again. pizzas now. This side How? You just, dude, I put a new rotor on it. <laughs> like, this was a month ago. What are you doing, guy? The caliper's fucked, and they just keep fucking. Just... Oh, yeah, you still didn't get a new caliper. Nah. <laughs> Alright, well, Nick just ordered, would you order a large fucking... Mashed potato bacon pizza, dude. We're about to go fuck around and uh, eat that. Watch some fucking South Park in my heated railing shop van loft. Hey, 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 family guy on South Park. All right, guys. In the comments, what's better, the South Park Christmas episodes or the Family Guy Christmas episodes? I think the OG South Park episodes are better. No. Yeah, like season friggin' like like one through like eight. Nah, dude, I like the crude drawings better, but let me, let me just post up in my heated shop railing loft van 7-3 table. What? What is that? Oh, dude, they, they thought we were having a party. For a large with, pizza? With we have one, one large, large pizza. Dude, now I can do something with my dip. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Disgusting. Who Why does this fuck? thing keep going to manual focus? Manuel Who needs focus. This, dude? Dude, just, just put it over there somewhere. You're so confused. Yo, what? Usually just the base is it, but they just yeah, like... Yeah, no, this is the whole thing. I mean, I don't mind. I, I'm, I'm curious to see how good it is. Look at the amount of brake dust that came out of this shit. Dude, like, why? <laughs> I why just put that rotor on. Dude, what? That... So these are the pads that I did... One month ago. Literally a month ago. <laughs> this dude got that machine finish. <laughs> Anodized. Nice. Very good. How to break your calipers. <laughs> this is the only way to get rotors off a Corolla. This is what I did last time because this is a super attached. <laughs> oh my God. I got it. I fucking got it. <laughs> Much better. E. So we're gonna run, Nick's gonna return those brakes, and I told him the conditions of um, me doing. Oh, he's already out. <laughs> oh no, he's not. I told him the condition of me doing his brakes, he has to fill Callie's tank so she has nice gas. Look at this friggin' thing, it's lifted as heck. I think it's pretty damn high up. I don't know if you guys can tell, you probably see on this side. <laughs> She's gonna be like, what? Your alignment's a lot better. Thanks. <laughs> I think it looks cool. <laughs> I'm not saying you like you did a bad job, but I just hate seeing my car at this height. <laughs> I think it looks Ew. cool. <laughs> I think it looks cool. <laughs> oh my god. It's so ugly, but it's kind of cool. Yeah, like just go like stand. Like you can see my coilovers, which is kind of cool because you see like the gold. Like yeah. I'm like, um, dope. Raceland. Yeah, I'm dope. Go sit in it. <laughs> just go like look at it. You want to drive it? A little bit. <laughs> well, now your keys are inside. Isn't it? We like get in it. Like sit in it. Is that weird? Not like I didn't sitting have to, down. I like, throw my body yeah. into it. <laughs> really it's pretty cool. damn high up. And it doesn't pull to the left anymore. That's crazy. No, no Froden. Dude, 
it's perfect. It's not pulling. Yeah, it's like off alignment, but it's not yanking me. You know? Exactly. Yeah. We need like some inner tie rods in this, John. Yeah. It's so weird. I'm so high up. <laughs> Right out of the heck car and into the mint car. Or back into the mint car, I should say. So Mike's just been chilling here for, I don't know, 20 minutes while I did all that. It's okay, Mike is a good gay, I trust Mike. This dude looks like he's asleep. Are you sleep up there? <laughs> I can smell the fucking paint, Chris is painting. But yeah. Callie's car, matching wheels, no more shitty tires, snow tires, lifted, Nick's brakes done, Callie's tank is full, it's a good day, you know. Mike didn't burn down my shop, Hacker Garage, Damien Monty, Orion, Dinovich, Arson, you know what I mean? <laughs> so like, oh my God. it's a good thing me and Orion weren't at this shop. Yeah, you know? no, you can't, you it's, can't have potatoes and bacon with and no damn sauce. With no sauce. Sketchy fucking moves. That's mostly it besides this good freaking news that I showed you guys earlier But I'll go over again in case you missed it, you know So my buddy Johnny sent me this turbo like I said before so boom there it goes I think tomorrow what I'm gonna do is make up my oil drain that'll go into the valve cover um, I think this right here. I'm not sure. I don't know like I Feel like this is supposed to be for a brace that would go to like right here so I could probably make that tomorrow um, and then there's another leftover stud right here at the end that, I don't know, but I mean, you got one bolt, two bolts, and three bolts that all go in, so I guess this is just how it goes, some weird way, some odd reason, but the turbo's mint, there's zero play in the damn thing, super happy with it, extra small turbo, what is it, a TDO4, yeah, TDO4L, so it'll spool up mint, dumb quick, I'll have low end torque, I'll be able to make it up hills, which is tight, you know, that's always cool. And uh, I saw somewhere where to put the coolant lines. So I came up with the idea of just using a turbo screen for this so I don't have to do an intake. I don't know which years have the map, or the math, but my car doesn't have a map, so I don't need to run a map. I think it's the OBD1 cars that have the map, so I'm good. My shit's speed density AF, boy, I'm just gonna friggin' put... Old turbo screen on that, run these coolant lines where they need to go, then run the drain, get a T off of this right here for the feed, boom right there, and then it's officially a turbo engine, you know, I got the water pump, turbo, all the things, and I won't have no stupid long intake anywhere. Oh, actually I need a, if anyone has a Forester, I feel like someone hit me up at some point, if anyone has a Forester XT top mount or a Hawkeye top mount, I think those two work the best. Um, let me know and you can send it to the link in the description if you send it out within an, like a, a day or two I think it should still get there, but the P.O. box closes the 28th So just be wary of that if you're shipping from dumb far, but yes, I just had to show you guys that real quick I don't know what this goes this bad vacuum line. Yeah, probably blow off um, I don't know. I'm not sure to be honest Fuck's sake, dude. Useless over here. <laughs> With Nissans, mint. Dude, With Subis, he's yeah. like, oh, fuck, this is what a turbo looks like on these things? Well, I mean, it should <laughs> like generally be the same principle for most yeah. boosted things, I would think, but I've never yeah. worked with these before. So oh, yeah, I also need a blow-off so. valve. Not a diverter valve, I need a blow-off valve. Hey, I got one of them. A Subaru blow off valve? I have a blow off I mean, it's a blow off valve. No, the ones, that, the ones that go onto the stock um, intercooler. That's the one I need. Not Because like, I'm not going to have any charge piping. Oh. You know okay, what I mean? Well, it's just going to go from here. I don't have anything for you. Never mind. Because I, I have an HKS. See, and I fucking HKS. useless. Dude, I have, a, I have so many S chassis parts. Like, oh, by the way, I'm going to plug myself no, right now. No, go ahead, dude. Um, if anybody's looking for S chassis parts, I'm parting out my entire setup. I got a few things left. Um, I have a really nice SR for sale, actually. If you go on my Instagram, which Damien probably linked earlier in the video. I'll link it right here, here again. Um, you can check it out. Uh, you can see some pictures of it. Trying to get rid of it. Uh, partying out all my S chassis stuff, so I'll probably put a picture up on my Instagram so you guys can see what I've left. But yeah, I got S chassis parts. All yes. Over the place. So I will plug his shit. Go to you're from Florida, so I, yeah. I know a good amount of you guys are from Florida. So if you want some S chassis parts, some cool drifty things, you're parting out that subframe, or is it already gone? Uh, I parted out most of the stuff that's on there, but the subframe I still have with GK Tech solids. Um, I mean, I buy legit parts. So yeah. Just... Mike is not fucking around, you know. <laughs> But yeah, also, we picked up that first uh, shipment of stuff from the P.O. Box. I said I was going to open them on Christmas, or Christmas Eve, so you guys get the video for Christmas. So that's what that's going to be. 
Um, didn't open anything yet, but everything will be open on video. Every last damn thing. Even if it's someone sending me some dickhead shit, I'm still gonna open it because it's gonna be funny. And uh, yeah, I don't know. That's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't. You guys know the deal. Peace.